when I sit at the table, I'm the engineer. But I sit next to an infantryman who has his own culture and his own background and his own way of thinking. And next to him is a cavalryman who also has a very unique, very bold, assertive culture. And next to me on my left will be an artilleryman who has a certain very uh, technical and uh, results-oriented way of thinking. And, and so in the Army, we have different branches. Um, I've just named a couple of them, but there, there are many. There's you know, air defense, military police, there's veterinary science, there's medical service corps guys, there's, you know, you, you name it. It's, it's almost as broad as the civil populace. And, and we're very disciplined in getting one of each type of thinker down to sit at the table at the same time so that you come, across, you come up with an interdisciplinary approach um, to any of the real important and complex problems. To fight against ISIS and survive in the face of Syrian pro-regime forces and Russian supported forces, right? That's going on today. And we look at, we're going to come up with a solution for how we're going to support that force. Um, when we solve big problems like that, it, you know, you can use many problem solving methods. We use our own planning method, you know, but you could use the Harvard business planning model and you, there, there's dozens. The one we use, um, we generate different courses of action. So we're going to have three different courses of action. We're going to support the SDF, we're going to not support them, we're going to support them with a certain amount of stuff. Um, we, we will go around and make sure that every culture and disciplinary background gets comment and um, creative license with each one of those courses of action so that they are um, a fully interdisciplinary approach. You know, and we do that in depth and very deliberately without skipping or ignoring any of the inputs so that we get the most creative solutions. Um, and then we'll take three or four sets of solutions like that and kind of compare them against each other and work towards a more optimal solution for whatever campaign we're designing. That, that's an example.